this is the energy vibration lesson for um, the Obsolete Manson. As you bank up water, um, to see November, November um, um, 29th and December um, um, 17th, this is your energy vibration lesson, okay? This is the 13th sign. Um, ik moet zeker tekenen iedereen bedankt voor de stoom, bedankt voor de, um, de help, de succes. Um, meer stil van jullie beginnen jezelf om te vinden, je begin jezelf om te zien en te beginnen om um, een verstand van jezelf te krijgen. Dat is best wel goed, omdat um, uh, er zijn heel veel dingen dat de mens op deze harde is niet geweten. Jullie zijn de meest belangrijke mens op deze harde. Op van wekens dat jullie zijn genezers, oké? Okay? En um, jullie dragen een soort of uh, energie dat niet andere mensen hebben deze energie niet. En um, jullie krijg alles wat je wil in je leven, je moet gewoon het in een goed positieve manier brengen. De algemene energie, de general energy voor this week is de energie of water, emotional transformation, en de um, zodiac energy is de energie van de earth. Um, what we see here and what we're understanding and how we are going to see things is that we are understanding certain aspects, certain things, certain situation, what is happening. And what you need to understand is that there is a um, different situation that is going to transpire. As I can look at your week, you have uh, um, the energy of uh, the Knight of Cups coming towards you. This is the energy of the Knights of Cups. So the Sagittarians have the same reading. And because you guys were seen as Sagittarians, uh, um, which wasn't true because they should have all told everybody about the 13th sign but they didn't want to tell you about the 13th sign because you are one of the most powerful people on the planet so if you were born on November 29 until December um, um, 17 you or you can heal or you can break someone you can heal or you can break someone you need to use this energy in a positive way whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring you are going to have to deal with the energy vibration from the knight of cups go and listen to the Sagittarians reading because this knight of cups had come in to do and have an afflict meant on the Sagittarians ladies okay so this knight of cups it can be a woman or a man with the energy vibration it can be a woman or a man with the energy vibration of uh, um, someone between the age of 25 and 45 it can be a woman or a man a boy or a girl um, and um, this person um, have done something to some of you ladies out there this can be your child this can be a person this can be your child this can be someone who has um, made um, something a transformation and something that happened okay so all right let's move on and let's go ahead and let's look and see what is happening here okay so this week is a positive week for you guys i'm seeing now a, a lot of wonderful um energies that are coming up i'm seeing now a, a lot of wonderful energies that are coming up um for you guys um and um on, on monday you have an earth element which is very very good and this earth element is uh, um, it can be the energy vibration of some of you men over the age of 40 that is trying to build on um, bill really on your financial um, situation the energy of the nine of cups comes up on Tuesday which is um, um, very positive I, sh I will show you the card very positive then you have the three of cups so this is very good so you have the nine of cups and the three of cups this is extremely good a celebration you have ju um, judgment that is coming in on Thursday this judgment is going to um, bring the, the judgment that is coming in on Thursday is going to bring you inner strength and guidance. Okay, this judgment that is coming in is going to bring you inner strength and guidance, and the energy of the sun comes out. Okay, on on uh, on a Saturday, and uh, um, the Ace of Cups comes on Sunday. So, okay, let's go deeper in your reading and see what is happening on Monday. Um, this energy can be the energy of you guys because. What you should know about yourself once you're born 
from November 29 until December um, 17 what you should know about yourself is that you carry all four um, elements of the zodiac uh, uh, the elements um, so you have a, a part of you that is um, the air sign you have a part of you that is the water sign you have a part of you that is the earth sign you have a part of you that is the fire sign so you are using the energy of who you are um, the earth sign energy and you're building because this is the sign of um, the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn so this is the earth sign energy you are using this earth sign energy on Monday to build um, your financial situation to build on yourself and this is going to be good on Tuesday you have the energy of your wishes and dreams are coming true because this is what I need to say to you people and you need to understand who you are because um, there are certain secrets that are going to be coming out and this is one of it because I'm the only one that is doing the energy of the 13th sign a lot of people did not want you people to know who you are you are like one of the most powerful um, beams that is on this planet that is born between November 29 and number 7 and November and December 17 because you carry all four elements that means you have the power over all of the rest of the sign and if you realize you can have relationship with all of the rest of the sign because you carry their energy vibration okay as we go along in this year 2018 I will be giving you more information in these readings for you to understand who you are and understand the power that you have within you so you are using the energy the element of uh, the water sign and you're bringing magic you're bringing something you are bringing something for yourself you're bringing something in for yourself and this is the energy of the nine of cups the nine of cups is that you're bringing forward a wish uh, um, that you needed to come true okay the crowning of your week is the three of cups another wonderful there's going to be a celebration in this week for you people there is going to be such a celebration that is happening in this week there is going to be a positive celebration that is happening in this week and with the celebration that is happening into this week you have a sense of um, information that is going to be coming at you information that is going to come at you that is going to make you um, um, have to find inner strength and this inner strength is going to bring you to a place of positive so on Friday a Thursday information is going to be coming on, uh, at you and on Friday what you're seeing happening is that you're going to find the inner strength but on Saturday the energy of the Sun comes out and this is going to be powerful this energy of the Sun comes out which is going to be powerful and which is going to be good and on Sunday you have the Holy Grail and I call this card the Holy Grail because it is your guided angels the universal angels are coming in to bring you new love okay so the Sun is shining and um, you are seeing this positive energy and the Holy Grail um, is coming out and is showing you a way forward there is new love that is going to come in on Sunday okay so we're going to look and break down your readings and this is a powerful reading for you guys because this is just so um, just none of this card because on Friday this is your own energy vibration this is the the, the 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 strength this is who you are this is what you use to be the masters of all the rest of the zodiac energy this is your energy the, the power of your energy because this is a sign of a, um, a woman is fighting the beast the beast is the, in this it is the lion and the lion is and have the energy vibration of um, the lion is and have the energy vibration of the thing so this is wonderful and this is good this is powerful because um, this reading is actually a positive reading this reading is actually a good reading this reading is is good because what is happening is that you are showing up for yourself now you are understanding if you always notice and if you have been um, watching my readings the Sagittarians are always having very, very, very um, good readings because um, the 
um, the planet of Jupiter um, govern, but you guys are governed or another total solar system. And this is, if you know your sign, your sign is the man fighting with a snake. Okay, the snake around the stick. That is your um, character and your energy vibration. So this is wonderful. This is powerful. This is good. So whatever the situation that is happening um, in your life, this is no question because what it is saying I don't really have to question this and um, not much because um, what we're seeing is that you're using on Monday your power of the earth energies uh, um, to balance out your financial situation to build a strong um, strong stable situation for for yourself and you have the nine of cups and this situation with the nine of cups uh, um, is uh, your wishes and dreams are going to come coming out and a celebration and there is like judgment it's as if something came up and there is going to be like a judgment and you're going to stand there with the, the sign of the infinity and then you have the energy of the Sun comes coming out and you have the energy of uh, the cups energy so this is positive this is good this is wonderful so whatever that you have to deal with with the people who are um, between the ages of 25 and 45 and as a, a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion you are going to uh, um, you're going to um, celebrate because you're going to um, get over this situation you're going to put them um, in their place and you are going to be aligning yourself with positive more positive energy and more positive people you're going to see um, what they have done and they are going to be coming back and you stand away and hold them off at base okay um, whatever that has transpired with you um, here you are here is the energy that the lies and whatever that was told it is now the lies and everything is coming out and this is going to be seen the energy that you have oh my god I love this energy and <laughs> I told you guys who you were because nobody didn't want it to tell you this is the fire element you and the Sagittarius hold the fire element I've been seeing this coming up because this came up also for the Capricorns so there is definitely a situation that is transpired in this year 2000 and um, the guides and angels are showing the situation that's happening because you have the energy of fire elements and you carry that fire in in you you have the element you're a healer you carried this fire in you and it says I ignite the fire within me that connects me to the divine and you guys need to start doing this from this year because you realize who you are you need to ignite the fire within you what you don't know is that whatever you touch you can turn it into gold you can um, heal it and you can bring it magic in that world what you're not understanding is that you are and you have and you will change whatever you touch whatever you touch because you carry the healing energies and um, this is what I've and, and, and I'm saying this to you guys again please be aware that you have the power that you can heal someone but you can also kill that person and it is um, I don't want to put fear in you but um, it's just as if um, and this is what it's saying the fire element I ignite ignite the fire with me within me if you ask the fire element and you ask the universe to ignite the fire within you do not use it for the wrong things do not use it to hurt people because it's going to be bad for you you were granted the special gift that you have because they know that you could use the gift in a right and proper way okay so I ignite the fire within me that connects me to the divine okay this is your message for this week remember it's just a positive positive week use the energies in this week you're going to be okay um, learn who you are go within ask your guides and angels to release your blueprint tell them that it's time you would like to know who you are 
your gifts are going to be awakening in the year 2018 use it to do good okay because I'm telling you I am um, many many years ago I wasn't aware of this and um, there was someone who was very close to me that was born December in December close to in the teens December in the teens and it was it, it, it was wonderful because I met this person and I it's as if I knew this person my entire life and I've just met the person and by sitting down with a person talking to the person I had gained insight of the future with this person the friendship that we would have had with this person and it was everything that I saw the day that I was sitting down there I see the future and it happens and um I was dealing with this person and I remember one day I wasn't feeling um, well and this person came by and I said oh my god I'm not feeling well and I said can you put your hands on um, my my stomach because I was having stomach pain and the person put his hands on my stomach and oh my god the pain was gone I was like hmm this is weird and then when I started to go deeper and I started to uh, in 2006 after my mom died and I um, started studying and going deeper when I started collecting information about my book my first book I realized who this person was and I'm thinking and I've been watching and I've been looking to see why is it that the astrologic people are not focusing on these sign what is it and then I realized that they didn't want people to know the truth about them because we are being lied to us ever since we were born because we are not who they say we were born you guys are not Sagittarians your guys are somebody totally different from a totally different planetary system that governs you you carry the four element you have the power within you that not even myself have because I carry two energies, but you guys have all four elements. And um, I'm seeing, and I was listening to someone who uh, does the zodiac energy for, and, and the person said, Yeah, that each and every one of us carry all the four elements. No, you guys are all the ones that carry the four elements. So this is a year that is going to be an, a learning year for you guys because then you are going to see the magic that you carry within I am asking you guys please to use it in a positive way do not use this to do negative things to other people use it in a positive way I want to say to you namaste until next time I speak to you mm -hmm.